Goal four, field hockey state championships. This is the class L title game between Darian and Staples. A great game at that. Blue Wave down 2-1 in the second quarter. How about that from Kate Bach? A long range missile. Sydney Johnson might have gotten a stick on it. Either way, it's a goal. Ties the game at two. That was the score at halftime. Wreckers are attacking in the third. Ball knocked around. Alex Hackett in the right spot to sneak it in. The senior scoring in a championship game to help lift her team to victory. That's storybook stuff. Staples beats Darian 5-2. It's state title number six for the Wreckers. Um, I've had earlier teams that have overachieved, uh, but this is by far the most talented. Uh, I'm very blessed to have girls like this on my team. It makes the job much easier. Uh, and they've done everything I've asked, but I, I think on, on the whole, as a skillful team, this is the most skillful I've had. Congrats to Staples. Other field hockey scores, two super close games. Early in the day, Guilford beat Branford one zip in double overtime. Cassie Ward scored the winning goal, and the Grizzlies are Class M winners. And then later in the day, Chapag Valley beat Sacred Heart Academy to win the Class S championship, the Spartans' first state title in 22 years. And that's not all. East Haven High School played host to volleyball state championships. Here are those results. Joel Barlow beat Granby to take home the Class M title. Title. Farmington defeated Bristol Central to win Class L, and Darianne took down Glastonbury to capture the Class Double L championship.